Hey, what is up guys, I'm Andrew Tech. Welcome back to another video. And on this video, we're gonna be taking a look at the Vankyo C750 wireless active noise canceling headphones. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Accessory wise, you get the micro USB cable, a 3.5 millimeter auxiliary cable, and a bag that is made of this type of cloth material so you can store the headphones whenever you are not using them. And finally, the instructional manual book and obviously the headphones themselves. Bell quality on these headphones is decent. It's definitely not the best though compared to some other headphones, especially at this price range, but I guess it's decent. They are made out of plastic, but the plastic on these feels a bit cheap and overall not the best build quality, but then again, these are only under $100 so you shouldn't be expecting a higher quality build. But I guess time will only tell how good the build quality is on these headphones because like they say, you can't judge a book by its cover. On the right side of the ear cup, this is where you find most of the controls or all the controls like the volume up and down buttons, power on and off button, and a 3.5 millimeter port and finally the on and off switch for the active noise cancelling and yeah these have active noise cancelling and i was actually a bit surprised on how good the active noise cancelling does on these headphones the active noise cancelling blocks most of the sound and overall i would say the anc is definitely usable unlike some other headphones especially at this price range also on the right side of the headphones you have a microphone implemented which is nice to see especially from these budget headphones so that means you can answer calls with these headphones and the mic quality on these headphones was actually pretty decent it's definitely usable because when i was making calls the other person on the other line said that i actually sounded nice and clear and they were able to understand what i was saying which was really nice to hear Comfort is an important rule when it comes to buying a pair of headphones and you definitely need to take that into consideration when buying a pair of headphones because at the end of the day, that's what you're going to be wearing on your head for hours and surprisingly these are comfortable even when wearing these for long periods of time and you won't get any type of ear fatigue or ear discomfort unless you start to wear these for over 5 hours but for casual listening, these get the job done. And the reason why I found these headphones to be comfortable is because these headphones are over the ear as opposed to on ear. So that means the comfort will be much better on these headphones. And these are no exception when it comes to the comfort. They do a really decent job in that department. Pairing these to your device is as simple as turning them on by pressing the power button for a few seconds and then turning Bluetooth on your device. And then you should be able to see the name of the headphones under your Bluetooth settings. Now onto the most important thing, at least for me, when it comes to buying a pair of headphones, how good do these sound? How good is the sound quality? And again, I was surprised by how decent the, these budget headphones do in that department as well. The mids and highs were pretty decent, but I did notice that they do get a bit distorted at high volumes, um, but it's not completely bad. Um, that's just something that I noticed and I thought I should mention it. The bass was pretty decent. You can feel it, especially when playing bass heavy music which is nice to see on these budget headphones. Now, I did notice one thing about these headphones and that is the amount of audio leakage when listening to music. It's just crazy how much audio these leak. So for some of you guys, this might be a little bit disappointing, especially if you are in a bus or anywhere where you don't want people around you to hear what kind of music you are listening to. Yeah, this might be an issue for you. But if you don't mind, then, you know, these headphones are extremely well. They sound really good, especially for the price. The bell quality, like I said, is not the best, but, it, you know, I guess only time will tell how good it is. Uh, the sound quality was decent. Comfort was amazing. Really excellent pair of headphones, guys, for under $100. And uh, yeah, that's going to do it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace.